chat to Paul for the locker room here. If you haven't already, please make sure to subscribe and let's just talk about it. The Buffalo Sabres and the Florida Panthers had a lot on the line tonight. Buffalo needed a win to stay in playoff relevancy and Florida needed a win to actually get into a wild card spot. This game was a must win for both teams. Let's roll the clips. Darlene here at the point passes it over to Cousins, walks right into the wrister. That's one line definitely has to have. Good wrister by Cousins to get his shoulder on it, but... Yeah, one nothing Buffalo, but Florida will strike back. Ekblad from the point, and it was kind of a weird bounce. It went right off of the skate, right past Devin Levi. Funky bounce, 1-1 one, one, Florida and Buffalo at the point shot. Initially thought this was a bad goal, but look at Kachuk with the tip right here. No chance for Levi. 2-1 and the Florida Panthers would hold on to this lead to win the game. The story of this game was the goaltending. They were both phenomenal in this game. Devin Levi on 36 shots against made 34 saves for a 944 save percentage. He just keeps impressing fans how he's just seemingly come from college and transitioned to the NHL with no problem. And while Sabres fans, you might be upset with this loss, the future looks extremely bright with a goaltender like Devin Levi being your future. But let's talk about the man of the hour, the guy that really has been hot in his last four games played, Alex Lyon. On 40 shots against, 39 saves for a 9.75 save percentage. And this is just not a blip on the radar. Last four games, he played Toronto, had a 9.50, played Montreal, had a 900, and had a shutout against the Columbus Blue Jackets on April 1st. He's been playing really well. And for a career minor league goalie to come up and fill some big shoes with Spencer Knight being out due to his issues and Bobrovsky fighting illnesses shows that they have a quality third depth chart goalie in line. I'll be very clear. He's making some big time saves. They're not all muffins. So I love to see an underdog story. A guy that struggled to get into the NHL find the success now at this point in his career. But the question has to be, is his success sustainable? I love a good story and I hope he stays on a hot streak but just looking at his career numbers and trends I'm not very sure how much longer he can keep pulling this off Florida's got a decent team around him maybe that can help insulate him but there's even times on these saves he's making where his positioning is not perfect and I'll also put into context two out of these four teams he has faced has been Columbus and Montreal and neither of those teams are world beaters this gets into the conversation playoffs with Spencer Knight out for the foreseeable future Sergei Bobrovsky fighting illnesses if by chance they had to go with Alex Lyon, how successful would they be? I'm not sure they would get out of the first round. And this isn't to knock the Florida Panthers roster. I think they have a little bit underrated depth, but goaltending is an issue. Even Sergei Bobrovsky has just not looked great at times this season, and I'm not sure if he'll be able to flip a switch when it comes to the postseason. Once a team starts seeing a player more regularly, they will pick apart their weaknesses. Just because I love an underdog, I hope I'm wrong, but I don't think the success by Lyon is sustainable in the long term. I'd be interested to hear your thoughts below. Will Florida make the playoffs this season? And does Buffalo have a shot in heck of making a run here? I'm Captain Paul. I'll see See you in the next video. Back and that'll do it. 40 saves for Alex Lyon. And the Panthers jump into a playoff spot.